Hi guys, what's up? This is Mark from Entrepreneur Zone, but this is No BS Channel. And here we have, introduce yourself really quickly. Hey guys, this is Kfir. It's not my first video on the channel, so you're welcome to also uh, look back in the, the previous videos that uh, me and Mark have been doing together. I own a software company called DSM Tool. It's an industry standard for people who are practicing eBay dropshipping. We started in 2016, blew up since then. It was a, an amazing journey. And now I also am a creator of one of the courses in the platform Entrepreneur Zone uh, that Mark is leading. Um, yeah, the eBay dropshipping course. Okay, so those of you guys who've seen us before, Kafir and I were, were competitors. I had a software program as well for eBay dropshipping. And when I was looking for someone to do the course on eBay dropshipping for entrepreneurs on, it was really important that I got someone that has our perspective because building software for eBay dropshipping, you have to understand the strategies of the, of the different people. You have to understand as a kind of bird's eye view of how big the market is and all that stuff. So even the course that Kofir produced for us for Entrepreneur Zone, I expected to come from a different place and go a little deeper than the typical course on the internet, right? And what are you, you guys who watch YouTube, I want you guys to understand when someone has a course, a lot of times it is valuable, but for me personally, I need to understand why they're developing the course. Because most YouTubers de de developing a course is a business, right? But Kafir coming from a position of having a, a software platform, why, I know I asked you to do the course and like for you to take the time and sacrifice to develop training for some people, there needs to be some sort of deeper reason why you're willing to put in the time. So why did you do this course? Like, why did you do it? What do you get out of it? What do people who do the course would get out of it? Right. So um, I wonder if I want to answer the, the question of why did they do the course at all or why did they do the course and then chose entrepreneurism? So maybe the entrepreneurism could be the next okay, uh, you get question. About, but why did they do the course at all? So it's actually very simple. What, what I found out is that DSM tool as a brand blew up and became so popular and so searched and appears in so many places online and that all, all happened between 2000, uh, from 2016 and on. But the, the thing was that a lot of things from 2016 that were back then part of the standard of how you do eBay dropshipping has changed. For example, eBay came up with a new policy, which is called the uh, dropshipping policy in the beginning of 2019. And a lot of the courses that were out there that were, you know, talking about DSM tool, just stopped being sold or don't or aren't existed anymore because they became outdated and irrelevant mm -hmm. yet we still we as a brand still kept having tons of people registering to dsm tool looking for like to get started with something so we just realized hey we need we need we need to educate people how to get started the right way without them you know, getting started by learning just from YouTube, whatever they, they stumble upon and then start doing it and making tons of mistakes. And I said, and because I'm familiar with every, almost every single strategy, strategy that exists out there for good and for bad from, from the, you know, we did a video together uh, on your YouTube channel about white hat methods and black hat methods. So from the most simple, and, and, and uh, straightforward methods that, that, can, that you can work with, which are uh, down to the most illegal methods that are being used right. uh, for, to do eBay dropshipping. I'm familiar with everything. And I wanted, to, I wanted to give people the platform to learn the course as a platform, to learn how to start doing eBay dropshipping in a proper way, in an organized way. And, you talked about like you wanted a, a more detailed course. So that, that's also something that was very, very important to me. Because when I see people that are looking to start a business online, when I see people that, are, that want to make money online, and then they start by just looking for, you know, I just want to make an income online. This is, this is my goal at, when I start looking for that. And when they get started and they started, start meeting all kinds of methodologies, they very quickly find out that eBay dropshipping is one of the easiest methods to get started with, which is an amazing thing, right? A very, it's like a, this course is like a business in a box. Right. You take the course, 
couple of days later, you have a running business. And yeah, it takes time to grow it, et cetera, et cetera. But the problem is that in, at the same time that it's so easy to get start, started with, people are a lot of times lacking the understanding of what does it mean to start a business? What does it mean that I'm starting my own business? What does it mean in terms of time management in my life? What does it mean to start business in terms of um, the way that I need to be organized? Just in terms of task management, you know? Mm -hmm. What does it mean in terms of my commitment towards customers that I suddenly have? Because suddenly you start having customers that are buying from you. And this is, yeah. it's, if it's something that you have not been doing before, then there are aspects to it that are not just what buttons to click on. And, you know, I myself took, um, I took a lot of courses myself of eBay dropshipping to see what people are educating. And, and you know, DSM tool as an industry standard software was promoted in every single course around the world. Right. Not every, but in yeah, yeah. so many courses around the world. And, and when I took a lot of courses, I saw that people are being taught, okay, this is what you need to click on. Go and click on that when you, you got an order. Okay, you need to click here, you need to click here. And I was like, wait, wait a second, wait a second. <laughs> what about teaching people why are you, why is it built that way? Why is eBay built that way? I'll give you an example. Uh, when you get an order uh, on, when you, when someone orders something from you on eBay, right? It's a marketplace. You get a notification in something called the seller hub. I explain it all in the course. What is the seller hub and everything. But in that seller hub, you have like a section called tasks. So basically eBay gives you a task. It's time to fulfill the order, right? Someone mm -hmm. made a purchase. For, someone purchased something from you. Now you need to ship him whatever it is that you're selling. Mm -hmm. But when they write in the, in the eBay seller hub, when they write your, the task, they write print, label, and ship. And for dropshippers, when we do dropshipping, yeah, yeah, yeah. we, we don't need to print any label because we don't physically ship anything ourselves. So right. this is just the tiniest example for terminology that is being used on eBay, for a way that eBay is built, that I think that when you're starting a business, when, you start, when you're deciding to open a business on a marketplace like eBay, it's important that not only you would understand how to do dropshipping, which is ridiculously simple, Right. But you would also take that opportunity to learn how to start a business. You will take to learn that, the opportunity of understanding why is this business model working? What is this business model based on? How does eBay look at their customers from, from starting from a, a 30,000 feet overview down to, you know, we, we talk, we start, the first chapter is all uh, theoretical. We start from a 30,000 uh, feet overview, understanding the surface that we're going to work on, and then only then diving deep mm -hmm. into looking into specific details. Mm -hmm. And <laughs> I... <laughs> well, one of the re let me just say one thing. One of the reasons why I had postponed launching the Amazon course is because what you just said, when I was producing the course, my course, right? Mm -hmm. And in speaking to you, only when we have these conversations, I get to look at these courses differently. Because generally when courses are produced in this world that we live in now, is to be like, hey, you can make a lot of money, go do that, just click some buttons, don't understand anything. And I right. think that is one of the reasons why the success rate is so low, because a lot of the course creators have to, first of all, pretend like the success rate, success rate is 90, 100%, which is never is, right? You're starting a business. And right. then by not going into the details and making it seem like it's more basic than it really is, is why people are not successful. And, Mark, and one, one of the most important things that happens in the eBay dropshipping course that I produced is that I struggle in the, like I give a lesson and then in the middle of the lesson, something doesn't work. And instead, <laughs> of, instead of recording that lesson again, I'm stopping and I'm saying to the camera, guys, I am so happy that it happened just now, that this doesn't work. And I'm going to find our workaround together with you because I want you to understand that if I would record this course just showing you everything working, it wouldn't be the reality that you would meet right after. Because in reality, right. every single day, you're going to encounter things that you have to overcome, challenges from small buttons that, that you know you need to click on and doesn't work perfectly, all the way to, to I don't know, to to 
dealing with with processes on uh, that are related to building a business that you will have to to figure out and as as educators that try to teach people how to do business online it's our responsibility not only to teach here here this is how the flow look like but to give you the confidence and the tools to become a business owner right because you're serving uh, and that's the thing a lot of people if you look at what people even search for they search for like what to sell the top selling items and strategies and all this stuff and at the end of the day there's another human at the, at the other end of this process as a client that's buying something physical from you that expects it to show up on time that you're gonna have to give customer service from the you have to understand why they're searching for this stuff so it's 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 and i looked at as i told you i looked at over 10 of the videos from the course so far and I'll give my own review by myself about it because I want to give like a realistic review for everyone. But okay, so we talked about why you want to do the course. Now, why should someone want to do, we'll get into why you did not entrepreneur zone. We can do that at the end. But why would someone want to do your course? <laughs> That's a great question. I think that the reason that you would want to take that course is one of the maybe basic courses that you take. Let's say if you join Entrepreneurs and you have a selection of courses and you wonder what should I start with, then first you would want to take that course because eBay dropshipping is probably one of the most easy techniques to get started with e-commerce. It's a very easy to get started with. It's very relaxed in terms of, of like how fast can you generate your, your initial sales it, it, there is tons of information out there that is free information on top of the course that you can find in, in order to expand your business and, and to learn further. And eventually, and maybe the most important part, the reason that you want to take that course is because this course is not about eBay dropshipping proper only. Mm -hmm. It's about how to start an online business. It's about what is search engine optimization, which is one of the main techniques that is being used in eBay dropshipping. How does it work? Why does it work like that? How does traffic work? How does buyers get into eBay, find your product and pay you more than what you would pay on the supplier side? Why does this business work? How to manage it properly? And also what buttons to click on and everything. <laughs> Trust me, I'm not missing a single button that you would have to <laughs> click on. I'm going over everything in terms of software, in terms of all of the websites that you have to work with. You would learn everything practical. It's a very practical course, but it gives you the background about everything else as well, about everything else that is business management as well. So this is why I think that it's a great, like if you're only thinking about taking your first course, if this is the first time that you ever starting your own online business, then I think that I try to structure this course to be something that is very, very easy to digest. It takes you step by step into the process of starting your own business. I even talk about task management and where to put your tasks and how to organize that in, in order to hopefully help you um, get started properly with the business, regardless to the question if it's eBay dropshipping or not. So right. no matter which business it is that you're going to start, if you're going to start an online business, I hope that by taking this course and by experiencing with eBay dropshipping, you would get some background knowledge and you would get some understanding about what does it mean to start an online business and what are the best practices that I'm, I'm going to share a lot from my experience of building, you know, building a, a software company that, you know, managing uh, dozens of employees, et cetera, et cetera. But, you know, I don't think that it's relevant to, to talk about how to manage dozens of employees. I think that what's, man, what's mostly relevant is to talk about how to manage yourself in that process. Yeah. And, and that, is, that is, okay, it's interesting that you brought that up because even when I did, for the Amazon course, I didn't touch on that too much, but I remember when I did a free eBay course a few years ago, I talked about like, how many actions you could take, how much time it takes in a day to do certain things, where to focus your customer service, try to estimate how much time you devote to things. And it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's mind blowing that I haven't seen that anywhere else. Like I've paid for thousand dollar courses and it's always what you say, like where to click, right? And that is, do you think, so I haven't, I have gone to school for mathematics, right? Do you think that your, your, understanding of the importance of that comes from going to business school, you think, or this is just through experience? 
Like, why do you see the value in that? As a as an entrepreneur and as a business person and as a course creator, and then where did that come from? I think that when I went to business school, a lot of the things that I learned were that part of, of looking at markets and looking at businesses from, from the perspective of like from, from above, from a 30 feet, at, I said it already, 30,000 feet uh, above, l- just looking down at the ground and, and understanding the process from A to Z and, and looking at companies that like, you know, when we did uh, case studies in school, we went through an entire story, an entire flow that the company goes through a period of time. And when, when we see online courses about eBay dropshipping, they're talking to you about what is it that you have to do in order to do eBay dropshipping, but they're not talking to you about the aspect of building a business and what does it mean? What journey are you right now committing to? And I think that the background is in business school made me feel when I'm taking a course online that I want the, I want to get both. I want on one hand to get the macro level of everything that, that is being taught, to understand why does it happen this way, to be able to criticize things that might be working and might be not be right. working. And I, you know, I begin the course by telling everyone, guys, if I'm saying something that you don't agree with in this course, I want you to tell me that. Because actually I heard you, Mark, saying that in one yeah. of your lectures. You were saying that when you were, were in mathematics school and you would think, how can I criticize anyone when I talk about mathematics? And yet, when you sit in a class in uh, whatever university it was, I can't remember that you took the, yeah. the class at, and the lecturer is talking there and you have something to say because you have criticism, you can raise your hand and you can say anything that is on your mind. And th- this is the environment that I wanted to create. This is the environment that I had myself in university. Right. Nothing is taken for granted nothing that i'm saying none of the methods that i'm going to teach are going are a hundred percent going to work and be relevant in a year from today and courses online are teaching uh, like that are trying to teach something because it's so important for them just to sell 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 what they're doing is they're talking about their methodologies like secrets that god has given them <laughs> that there is no way that would never work and in this course there's no chance that this is going to happen this course is like an open discussion because the development of the concept that is called eBay dropshipping is, is being developed by the community, not by individuals that are going to teach you some methodologies. I have no rights over eBay dropshipping methodologies. I did not develop them. You know, I am very, very familiar with them and that's why I teach them. And, but, but it has to be a discussion. It has to be something that is being created by the community. I also say that in the course, every methodology that I teach in the course, I teach it, but I also say, look, you can develop it further. You can find your own ways. You can find your own unique ways to build your business because there is no one blueprint on how to build a business, not eBay dropshipping and not any other businesses. There is a blueprint in the sense of what is the structure and what are the best practices that are, that are known in, in, the, in the industry, but other than that, like yeah. every other business, you have the opportunity to expand it to whatever direction that you, that you want. And if you're able to, then you should do it. If you are, if you're, what's up, I say it this way. If you're a smart kid, go ahead, no matter how, how old you are, right? Yeah. But if you're a smart kid, if you're a smart kid, then you would be able to develop it to different directions. I developed it to a different direction, right? I started by doing eBay dropshipping and I developed it into a software company. So you never know to which direction you're going to take it. But I want, if, you, if this is the first business you're taking, you should have a good ground and you should definitely not take anything for granted. Uh, okay, and you guys watching this video, hopefully you, take the t- hopefully you got this far and hopefully you took the time to understand where we are coming from, where Kafir is coming from, and why the course is produced. Because most of the other courses on the internet are produced to be sold as much as possible, right? I, as a business person, as an entrepreneur, is my goal is to start with the education first and try to monetize that, right? try to develop the best education possible first and go backwards. And a lot, of, a lot of the content and a lot of the reason 
be behind why a lot of online courses in entrepreneurship is produced is a bit counterproductive because it's an entrepreneur developing the course. And as an entrepreneur, you want to sell as much as possible and make as much profit as possible. So I'm not even seeing it as like, I'm not even criticizing why this make money online space is how it is. It's like that because it's built by entrepreneurs, right? But I just want you guys to, to actually take the time and understand. I think watching this video before you do the course is it, also very valuable because you can know where the information is coming from. Mark, let's put things on the table. I'm an entrepreneur. I have to go. This course, yes. Okay, let's go back to the question. Why yeah, am yeah, I go back. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Why am I producing this course? A, because I want to sell you the DSM tool software when you're taking this course. This entire course is based on the software that I developed, right? Right. <laughs> not, not all of the course. I also talk about other softwares. I talk about free things that you can use. I talk about a lot of things. But my main goal, the, my money-making machine, what's so called, is my software company, right? right. That's, what I, that's what I live off. But having said that, I, you don't want to criticize the industry of make money online. I want to criticize the hell out of this industry <laughs> because I also think that with all due respect to, as, you know, to the ways that I can monetize my knowledge and the ways that I can monetize the crazy secret that, I, that I've learned over the years, I grew up on the values that says that if, if it, that, that you can't fuck people over. This is right. the value that I want to say. And, and I am selling, uh, my, my software company has become the industry standard, one of the biggest software companies for eBay dropshipping in the world. I don't think that I'm as a person in the position to now create a, a course and sell it for anything more than the subscription of, of uh, entrepreneurs on. And I only think like this entire information is information that you can find for free if you would just do a little bit of research. So I gathered all of the free information that you can find. I put it in one place in the course. And then for that, for recording it and for all of that, you pay me. But Mark, we, sp we did a video about it, the, mm. one of the previous videos. I, we spent as a company over $2 million to build the software DSM tool. Yeah. And, we're, <laughs> and, it's, and it's starting from $25 a month a subscription, right? I spent on this course, what? Two months of my life, only me. I didn't need developers, I didn't need anything. I got the information, I recorded the course, I sent it, I, even, the edit, even the video editor I got from you, right? The, the, the video editor was in front of us does it really make like to me it just doesn't make sense to now take all of this knowledge that i have and sell it in a package for i don't know a hundred dollars a thousand dollars all of these things for me the real fair thing to do in our industry is to give up all of that information for that fixed price of entrepreneurs on together with all of the rest of the courses because i think that ebay dropshipping is such a basic business it's such a like basic thing to get started with. And it's just one stream of income that it's just unfair to do any, any other way that you would sell a, an online course about eBay dropshipping in my perspective sounds unfair. And all the people that already sell eBay dropshipping courses would have to forgive me for saying that about them. I mean, I'm sure that there are courses that teach things that are methodologies that are very, very specific that I'm not familiar with and then they would definitely worth it. But a basic eBay dropshipping course I'm sorry. No, and, and Nobody you, in the world should pay more than what you get together in the package of entrepreneurs and together with all of the rest of the access to all of the rest of the courses and the community. No, I agree with you because what is so mind blowing, right? Like we went to university. We came, we studied for four years, two years for masters, whatever, right? There are other of like influencers that went through formal education. And then mm -hmm. it actually takes a month or two months to create a course. Right. And then you, then a lot of people try to compare that month or two months of sacrifice with whatever history you have in the industry to like a formal education. And yes, you can generate income from these courses. Right. But there must be a line between, there must be an understanding of the years that some, like I've been in this e commerce industry for nine years and it's still not that involved or not that deep you you learn certain parameters and you learn how to like execute as quickly as possible and you could find success right and I, 
it, it's hard for me to articulate sometimes. It's hard for me to explain sometimes because so, it's so, people look at YouTube and people look at us as YouTubers as, as like better than them. But like a lot of people watching us would look at us as industry leaders. Okay, yeah, right. But a lot of a lot of these industry leaders don't realize that like don't allow the people watching them to know like like the people watching us are supposed to become us, right? Like this is not this is not Guru Mark on the internet saying buy my magic. <laughs> one one thing that I really hate is online gurus that try to teach courses. Let me tell you something. Let me put it this way. Guys, everyone that listen, I want you to know that, and this is something that I tell all of my employees. This is something that I told every student that I ever had. I was a teacher before I started the software company. I told it to my students. Look, you, the person that is right now watching this, me, an owner of a software company, and Jeff Bezos, the owner of Amazon, all of us, when we go to the bathroom to take, you know, to take a dump, yeah. From all of us, it's the same material that is going up. Trust me. <laughs> We're all made of the same thing. We're all just humans. We all have brains. And when online gurus are trying to teach you their secrets, it's a total bullshit in my opinion. And it's something that th there are no secrets. There is, no, there is maybe methodologies. There is maybe like ways to do things that I can teach you, which is great. But it's nothing magical. It's super technical and practical. And it could be easily taught. And this is why, like, th this is like, you know, part of the reason that this course is going out is because I want, I want it to be marketed not as if I'm an online guru, as if right. I'm a normal person that is sharing with you my knowledge, my experience, my information, and that's it. No bullshit. Yeah, and, and that's... Good. Thanks, Kafir, because you have explained a, a lot of the conversations that we have off camera, like talks about the type of stuff, and a lot of times it's hard for me to explain because I've been explaining this thing so many times and I've worked like it's the magic in this shit, the secrets in this shit, in my opinion, is that we have the fucking internet and we could sell $5 a day or $20,000 a day. That's the magic. The magic is to understand the tools that are now fucking available and build $100,000 businesses, $20,000 businesses, or million-dollar businesses. And that's the fucking magic. The secrets and the magic is not, is, is through the experience and through gathering education and continuing getting better and better and better, right? right. And like our experience, but we could give, we could teach from our experiences and we learn how to get better over time and our students maybe start a little ahead of us and learn from our experience. But that's it. Mark, not me, not you, not Kevin David, not uh, what's his name, the CEO of ClickFunnels, uh, Russell um, Branson. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. Can you help me with some name dropping of all of the, of um, the, all the gurus, gurus out there? Wesley, billion dollar Wesley, whoever, um, yeah. Ty Listen, Lopez. <laughs> Ty Lopez, yeah, I love this one. <laughs> none of us, none of us has the authority to tell people that what we are doing is going to change their lives. You know why? Because none of us is going to be there, hold their hands, hand by hand, move on and change their lives. What, we, what I did, what you're doing, what all of us are doing is we're building systems. I built a course for two months of my life. It's going to run out for two, three or five years yeah. and being sold and being taught on entrepreneurs and people are going to listen. I'm not going to take everyone hand by hand. It's not even possible for me. Yeah. And therefore, I cannot promise anyone that I will change their life. The power to change your life is in your hands and your hands only. I can only share with you my experience. I can only share with you my knowledge. And that's it. It's my responsibility to stay humble. And all of these gurus that are telling you that they're going to change your life, anyone that is promised you that are total bullshit. I, Kafri, thank you. I have, I have, I have nothing. I, okay. The last question. Why are you, you addressed it briefly. Why launch it on Entrepreneur Zone? You can just do it quickly. But yeah, that, yeah no but, problem. Look, but what you said, of, I couldn't say anything. What you said better, but go ahead. Sorry. One of the reasons that I decided to do it, to launch the course on Entrepreneur Zone, is because, as I said, a lot of things change in the industry of eBay dropshipping. And in comparison to 2016, it's much harder these days to scale your business doing only eBay dropshipping. 
back then we were teaching eBay dropshipping or we were doing eBay dropshipping and you could develop your online income only from that. It could be your only business and that would make a lot of money. Today, it can still make you money, but in order to scale it to big numbers, there are some illegal ways which I'm not willing to support and I do not cover in this course, but basically, generally speaking, as hard as it is for me to say that, it's a little bit harder to make a lot of money in eBay dropshipping, just doing dropshipping from retailers, just using those methodologies that are the basic methodologies. Mm -hmm. And therefore, for me, not for your audience, not for the people that are going to join entrepreneurs on not through my content or not, not my followers, what's so-called, and are going to take the eBay dropshipping course and then get introduced to DSM tool. Actually, for this, those people that sign up to DSM tool and want to start an online business, I want to say, guys, the best way for you to start, to start an online business would be to start from this course, but then have access to other courses that will create for you other channels of income. And maybe, you know what? Maybe they would make you even far more income and then eventually you would leave eBay dropshipping, which is supposedly, you know, I'm saying that just as a disclaimer because it's supposedly against what would benefit for me, right? I make money from the software for eBay dropshipping. But to me, I'm trying to care about the customer, about the person that joined the, the company DSM tool. And I want them to go through a journey where, yeah, they start, you start from eBay dropshipping, but from there you grow to different areas. And then either you manage an eBay dropshipping business and together with it, you have other channels of income or maybe another channel of income you would find out that works the best for you. I don't know, like uh, you have a course about uh, Instagram, uh, you have a course about Instagram, course about Amazon dropshipping, uh, courses about YouTubing. Yeah, if someone Reddit, would become yeah. Reddit, if someone would become a YouTuber and then would open a video blog and would do it the right way and would start generating thousands and thousands of dollars and that would be their business, that's wonderful. I'm happy for the opportunity to expose people to a huge amount of courses that are available that are all meant to create for them different channels of income where eBay dropshipping is only one of them. And the, the ability to give that offer as part of how I sell my course is like, you know what? My two options, and I told you that before, my two options were either I'm giving this course 100% for free, open for everyone. This is what I wanted to do initially, right? Mm -hmm. when, before we talked. Like we yeah. talked and I told you, Mark, I want to release this course 100% for free. And then we said, wait a second. What if we launch it in Entrepreneur Zone, which is not a free platform, right? It's a fixed price per month. Right. But when my cost, when I... Uh, uh, you know, try to sell it, what's it called, or, or offer it to my customers, to my followers, then uh, I would be able to offer it with a package with a lot of other courses that will create for them multiple channels of income. And that for me was such a winning offer because it like, it crushes all of the courses out there. It's like you're getting all of these courses that's supposed to cost thousands of dollars and you get them effectively for, you know, for a fixed price with no bullshit, with people that believe in education. And I was like, you know what? In that case, it's definitely worth it. And I'm going to release that uh, in Entrepreneur Zone. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Kafir. Like I couldn't, a lot of, a lot of time because we have similar values, mm -hmm. like you definitely articulate a lot of stuff better than I would. <laughs> but thanks a lot for your time, dude. And guys, I can't, I can't ask for anything more. Like I went through a lot of the course already. I'm going to go through it again a couple of times. I'm going to give a few feedback on what, what he can do better for the course. But like, this is definitely my goal. It's open for everyone. It's open for everyone. Everyone that takes the course, by all means, let us know what he could do better about it, what we could add, things you don't understand. Um, I'll put a link in the description to Entrepreneur Zone, to, to the, the, the page that shows the course and all that stuff. Along with the course, you'll get access to everything else, the Amazon dropshipping course, Instagram course. And remember guys, these courses, I did not wake up and make an Instagram course, right? I didn't wake up and say, you know what? I'm gonna make an eBay course to sell an eBay course. I reached out to Kafir who built the, the, the leading software in eBay dropshipping to create a course. The guy, Darius, who made the Instagram course, you can check it up. If you look up Young Hustlers, his Young Hustlers account has maybe 1.3 million followers, maybe two or 300,000 of them are bots, and that's what happened when you grow on Instagram. But he's showing you exactly what he did and what he continues to do to get results. So guys, the, 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 the information you're getting is coming from like real experience, 
from actual successful people. And hopefully you guys can use that information, take advantage of it, understand what works now, understand what works for you and what you do on a daily basis and continue making money. Like I can't, like I know this video is supposed or to- Or start making money. Or start making money. And I, I know this video is supposed to be on YouTube. So you need to like and comment and subscribe and all that stuff. But this is, I have been working on this, this idea of entrepreneur zone for maybe like four years. It wasn't called entrepreneur zone because I had shared this with one of my friends from a guy named Ty from California yesterday. And he was like, Mark, isn't it that thing you were working on when I first met you? And I even forgot that I've been talking about this and trying to figure this out for like four or five years, right? So it's, it's very, like, I feel very privileged that you are contributing to the platform now, dude. And I want the guys on YouTube, the watching this, to understand that, like, our goal is to change this whole making money online and entrepreneurship education thing. Because there more- is, You know, I, there is nothing that I could support better than this. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm addicted already to watch scammers online, trying to scam people and, like I, I watched so many of these videos already. I watched yeah, so many and, of these and, and it's, it's just, but guys, I, anyway, I hope that you guys, if you have any questions about the course, any questions about Entrepreneur Zone, any questions about why we're doing this eBay dropshipping, put that in comment section because it's really important for you guys looking at this content and doing the education to understand your position in this space. You can make a little bit of money. You are allowed to have an opinion. You're allowed to turn what we teach and make it better. And like any other education, like I treat, like me studying mathematics, you're in a laboratory. You're like, you're around other mathematicians, right? And you're allowed to figure out better ways to solve problems. We are trying to give you the ways we solve problems in our experience. And you guys, your responsibility as a business person is to take that information and make it as good and make it as profitable as possible for your business, not for us, right? This is the weird thing in this entrepreneurship game. Anyway, guys, like the video, subscribe to the channel. In the description, I'll put a link to DSM tools. You can try it for free. There's a free plan. I'll put a link to DSM tools, Instagram account, and YouTube. And I want to thank you for again for being on the channel again. And we'll continue this because we already posted a couple of videos about the eBay dropshipping debate. And we want to have a more real conversation about this space. All right. So thanks for your time. Thanks for your time, guys, watching this. Like the video. Go check out Entrepreneur Zone. Have a good one.